Hi everyone, my name is Armour and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Kylie Jenner, not Kylie Jenner, Kendall Jenner inspired makeup look and this is what it looks like. It's a very natural glowy look. She does very simple makeup and I'm going to be going off this picture. So yeah, I really wanted to do this because I did do a Kylie Jenner one. If you guys want to go see it, I'll leave it in the description below. But yeah, so I like this look. It's very natural but glowy and yeah so if you guys want to see how I did this look just keep on watching so first I'm taking my rose water just to prime my face and I'm putting that all over now I'm just taking my Cetaphil moisturizer now I'm just taking my Milani prime perfect primer putting that all over my face I'm just gonna do my eyebrows with my pomade and just fill them in. Because I'm doing this for the thrill of it, killing it, never not chasing a million things. And to set down, taking my Essence Make Me Brow Gel. To clean everything out, I'm just taking my Wet n Wow concealer and just like an eyeliner brush. But I use this for my concealer and I'm just putting it on my eyebrows. And I'm going to use this uh, concealer also to prime my eyelids. I'm going to put that anywhere else that I have a little more acne scarring so it won't be that noticeable when I put on my foundation. Oh. And I'm just going to blend everything with my Real Techniques um, beauty sponge and I'm going back in with my um, e.l.f. eyeliner brush that I use as a concealer brush and just blend my concealer. Now I'm taking my Cargo Cosmetics all around the world eyeshadow palette and I'm using Rome just to set my concealer, put it all over my eye, then I'm taking Shanghai with a crease brush and I'm going to use windshield wiper motions back and forth until I get the desired color I'm looking for for Kendall Jenner's eye look. Now I'm going to take Urban Decay's Midnight Cowboy single eyeshadow and putting that all over my lid for a little sparkle. Now I'm using the Ardell Double Wispies fake eyelashes. Now I'm just taking any mascara just to blend my real eyelashes with the fake ones I just put on. Now I'm just going to use the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in 110 and putting that all over my face. Going back in with my Wet n Wild Concealer, I'm just going to put that under my eyes and use it to highlight on my forehead and on my chin as well and my nose. Going back in with my Real Techniques Beauty Sponge, I'm just going to blend out all the concealer I just put on my face. Now I'm just taking this e.l.f. cream contour and I'm just going to put that on the hollow of my cheeks, under my chin, on my jawline, and on top of my forehead. Going back in with my Real Techniques Beauty Sponge, I'm just going to blend in all the cream contour. Now I'm just taking my Airspun Loose Translucent Powder and just a e.l.f. complexion brush and I'm going to set my face with it. Also with that Airspun Translucent Powder, I'm going to use it to bake underneath my eyes. To set my cream contour, I'm taking NYC's Bronzer in Sunny and just going to bronze up my face with it. And I'm going back in with my translucent powder just to sharpen up my contour. Now I'm taking an all over brush and I'm going to dust off the excess powder and I'm going to blend in my bronzer the same time I'm dusting off the powder. And I do this because it just makes the bronzer look more natural and that's what I usually go for. I'm just taking my brush and I'm spraying rose water over it because I love an intense highlight and I'm using my Mary Luminizer and I just go in with this. I put layers and layers of highlight and I especially love it when you put it on the nose and this is like such perfect look if you just want a more highlighted face and that's what Kendall Jenner usually wears. And now I'm just taking a setting spray to set everything. And now I'm just taking a random mascara and I'm going to put that on my lower lashes. I'm using the Flower Lip Liner in Taffy and I'm just going to line my lips with this. Then I'm going to go in with the Milani Lip Gloss in number 3 because Kendall doesn't really wear matte lipstick, she wears more lip glosses. 
So this is the finished look. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you like, give it a thumbs up. Uh, hit the subscribe button. I don't know which side it is. You can go follow my Instagram and my Twitter. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you the next time I post the video. But let me cue the typical beauty guru outro. <laughs>